Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Red Hot Chili Pepper Songs and Memories, where I talk about songs by the Red Hot Chili Peppers, and I talk about the memories they gave me. Now we're on day 20, I'm going to be talking about Righteous and the Wicked from Blood Sugar Sex Magic. Oh my god! I... Okay. I remember being so, like, this... The first time I heard the song I bought was when I listened to Blood Sugar Sex Magic all the way. And I'm like, this album's really good so far. And then when it comes, when it gets to uh, the bass where it's like, do 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 And then I was like, okay, this is actually really good. And then when the guitar hits, it's like, and then when the guitar actually starts to set emotion, I'm like, holy crap, this is just amazing. Keep in mind, this was in high school. Again, in high school, I thought things from the 90s, Talking about it now, I'm pretty sure I thought things, rock music from the 90s was amazing, like it blew me away. And then, uh, I was like, holy crap, this is amazing. And it's like, oh my god. Like, the verses, I'm like, oh my god, this is really good. This is really, really good. And then when it goes to the chorus, it's like, wretched in the wicked, war and peace. The bitter, the bitter, and the human beast. Sorry. P.O.P. Prodigies of Peace. And I'm like, oh my god, this is just so amazing. And then when it, uh, when he, uh, finished saying, Why don't playing for a better day? And then when, jo when the John is like, when, uh, the band is like, duh, 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 I'm like, holy crap, I love this part. I still really love that part. Like, that bridge between the verse and, the um, the chorus. Uh, no, the chorus before the verse, and it's like, I'm waiting for a better day. And I'm like, oh my god, I really love this song. Hell, this song was in my head when I went to Nigeria for three weeks. Because I was like, sometimes during the night when I went to Nigeria, this song just played out of nowhere, and I'm like, oh my god, this song is amazing. Why isn't why am I not listening to this right now? Maybe it's because it's not on my MP3 right now. Maybe it's because I didn't bring the CD with me. I don't know, but I genuinely really like the song because it's just so it's just so righteous and so wicked. And like the like I when I when the song ended, I'm like, okay, I want to listen to this again. And I'm just like, it just goes so hard into like this whole. Like, it's just so funky and rocky, in my opinion. Like, I thought uh, Suck My Kiss would be the funkiest, funkiest rock song on the album. And then it turns out I, see, I hear, like, Righteous and the Wicked, which I don't think, it's not funky, but it's just so, like, kind of punk and really punk. It's pretty much punk rock if, if, um... Suck My Kiss was more punky funk. This was more like punky rock. I'm like, oh my god, like, this is, this all is pretty much overwhelming to the senses. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure, like, I know a, there's somebody on Twitter who likes the song because this is from her favorite Red Hot Chili Pepper album, as far as I know. And I remember she put the song on Twitter, and I'm like, I, she's like, I can't get the song out of my head. I'm like, yes, this song is awesome. Righteous and the Wicked is awesome. It's, I'm, I think it might be my favorite song off the album. I mean, I don't have it on my MP3, but it pretty much goes to show, like, I'm going to listen to this album. I'm going to listen to this song only on the CD, not on my MP, any MP3 format. Sure, I might, like, listen to it on, um, what's it called? I'll listen to it on my phone at night, because the song is that good, and sometimes, like, you need that earworm, like, in order to get rid of an earworm, you have to listen to the song over and over again, and that's pretty much what, uh, the woman on Twitter said, it's like, I ha I can't get this song out of my head, I'm like, yeah, this song is insanely catchy, so freaking catchy, it's beautiful, it's absolutely great, it just, it fills my soul with so much, like, rock, it just feel it just rocks. It genuinely rocks, and I'm like, holy crap! I love this song. I love it so much. Ah. <laughs> oh, yeah. So.
Sorry. I don't know what else to say. It's just that it this song just rocks. Uh, so that's another episode of Red Hot Chili Pepper Songs and Memories, and I'll see you another time. Thank you.